Okay, still on Herbert Wigwing's memorial service. So today, uh, Peter Obi is here to pay the last respect to him and the family who he lost together with. So I still read that the video for you to watch. Though I don't know if you can be able to hear what he's saying. He understand. I don't know if I can be able to tap it. But for now, I think I cannot tap it for him. So you can pay attention. Call it earpiece. Make it put on there. Make it hear and well and well. Hear what did happen. So this is the last respect that we the living we are giving to these people. You understand? So I still have to say rest in peace. Still have to tell them rest in peace. Don't forget to drop it at the comment section. Tell them rest in peace because that is where everybody is going to tomorrow, not today. Thank you. To the Billy family, to Axel Bank, particularly my brother, I move. It's been almost a month of moment. There is nothing that we can do that will continue to express our heartfelt condolences, our sadness over the demise of the entire of this family. Together with his brother, the race access bank to level of among the first five top banks in Nigeria. Considering their ages to number one. Considering their ages, you can see that they are hard work paid off. So let me also extend the condolences of the federal government to the father and the mother yeah. of the late Heaven Children. And just like the governor of Rivers has said, the galaxy of senators, they are all there. Some may not have found space here. We are also grieving. The 10th Senate, even the 9th, 8th, and the 8th Senate that I won't be on, because my brother, we can't even succeed without the balance. As the family is crying, my brother of uh, Ken in uh, Namibia, when Ken was uh, the, the immediate past president of the we sat next to each other. And all the discourse of over two hours was this tragedy that has been coming in Namibia. He had a lot to contribute. But sometimes God gives signs. They say those that God loves most, He takes them in. He will make everything in heart. You see the fantastic structure of a retirement home for his son in Vegas. Or I even tell about even a beautiful university, one of the best in the world of West Africa that they are concluding. Are you talking about the shoes of the president? As a man of God pointed out, it is the journey that all of us who want to make. My prayer is that God should enable us to be ready before we make this journey. As a young child, growing up, I attended a burial ceremony of a 12 year old boy. And the man of God, quite rich, 